Hello, uh, Assalamualaikum and good evening to Dr. Farah, my fellow classmate and YouTubers who are watching this video. My name is Muhammad Taufik bin Haji Osman. I'm a semester 2 tester student at University Pendidikan Sultan Idris. Today, I am going to do a video review about a website that can improve one's English. Um, if I'm sorry if I look a bit nervous today because this is my first time doing this video. Uh, in this video, I will explain on why I choose this website, the positive about the website and a couple of negative about the website. So, I hope you all can gain benefit from my video. So, let's get started. Okay guys, the website that I'm using is called Activities for ESL students. I found this website through uh, searching the web and I found it very good and very user friendly as, it, as it, is, it is easy to use for students, especially students who have a low um, knowledge about how to use a website. This, this is because the data is specific and doesn't involve many other add-ons like um, there's a, there are more complicated website than this website. Uh, furthermore, this website can also help teachers too in helping to teach their students because they will be uh, exercises such as grammar quizzes, vocabulary, vocabulary quizzes and also crossword puzzles. And there's a, there's a, there are also special links and also external links to YouTube channel where they will explain on vocabulary and grammar and how to improve them. The other reason that I encourage students and anyone who wants to learn English to use this website because they can start from the bottom. This is because the website has three levels of difficulties which is easy medium and hard so students can use can do the exercise step by step and they can ask their teachers if they need guidance to proceed to each steps for example um, for easy they can probably do it without any problem and uh, when they are going to the next level, which is medium, they can ask their teachers to help them for explanation and on how to be better than the other level. Apart from the benefits of this website, there are also uh, some cons by using this website, but there are not many. The first con is the website has to be online. The stu students must have a, an internet connection to use the website unless the teacher print out the exercises before the class starts. The other reason is not many, uh, the other cons is not many students have the computer or laptops to, to use to get to this website, but they can always use their school's uh, computer labs to use to use this recipe to do this exercise. All right, that's all from that's all from me today about my website, which is activities for ESL students. I hope this website will benefits others and future students that wants to improve their English. Thank you very much for this opportunity uh, by Dr. Farah for me to make a video debut about this website. I hope I can improve myself myself for doing a better video review video. That's all from me today. Thank you.